91.1 The Globe. Good morning. It's the Breakfast Blend with Amelia here on this Thursday morning along with Jaden and Mike. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Well, part two of our iconic game. (laughs) Right now, Mike is in the lead. He's got four points for this reality TV show trivia. And Jaden, you've got one point, but you still have time. You still have a chance to Don't call of, it a comeback. <laughs> take, it, take it over. <laughs> the rally cap's coming back. So my first question is, a bricklayer, Craig Phillips, was the first winner of what British reality show, now American as well, in 2000 that took its name from a concept in George Orwell's 1984? Um, Britain's Got Talent? I don't know. No, George Orwell. I feel like that really helps. Oh, uh, Animal Farm. Uh... <laughs> Big Brother. No. You're so close. Oh, Big Brother, 1984. <laughs> Big, brother. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Big Brother's always watching. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You were I was trying there. to think. I was like, 1984? Uh, book burning? <laughs> oh. Well, I'm sitting there thinking, like, she's oh, going to the British like, ones now? Oh, no. <laughs> You're almost there. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, name for a, a romantic idiom. What's the name of the 2020 Netflix dating reality show that featured 30 men and women hoping to find love, speed dating without seeing each other? Blind date, maybe? I don't know. Uh, love is blind. Uh, you were on. <laughs> <laughs> um, my next question: Farah Abraham and Jordan Cash Meyer were among the stars of what 2010s MTV documentary series showcasing the problems that teenagers face when presented with the prospect of a child at a young age? Sixteen and pregnant. Yes. Oh, I thought it was Teen Mom. <laughs> no, she was. Farah Abraham actually started in Sixteen and Pregnant, and then they went to Sixteen Pregnant OG or like Teen Mom OG, and then Teen Mom. My favorite was Teen Mom too. That was where the dysfunction really <laughs> sets in. <laughs> and other than that, in Jersey Shore, you know, I don't know any. Oh, I forgot about Jersey Shore. <laughs> oh man, is Jersey Shore gonna be one of them? I can't. No, say. it's not. I don't know anything about that show. <laughs> uh, my next question: On what NBC reality competition do celebrity judges listen to singers with their chairs turned around? The or Voice. S- ah. Ooh, who got that? Oh, that was like that jinx was, right wow. there. You owe me a coke. <laughs> that was wild. <laughs> you, should, I, you, should, you should give it to Jaden. Yeah, Jaden, you got it. No, and, I don't need a sympathy <laughs> point. What? <laughs> and my last question is, premiering in 2009 on the G4 network before moving to NBC, what reality show known as ANW for short features competitors attempting to complete difficult obstacle courses? American Ninja Warrior. Wow. Oh. Good job. I'm like, I'm like A-N-W. Oh, no, I'm like sitting there, I'm like, it's American Ninja like, Warrior. Oh. Wow. wow. I, I literally lost track. Who won? Oh, Mike won, 100%. Mike. Good job, Mike. You are oh, a winner. Thank you. I'm very, I, uh, what do I win? You win the bragging rights of the reality TV show. I'm going to bring that into the rest of my day. You should. You should be like, I know more about TV than you do. And <laughs> you can live your life as such. But we're going to head on over now to the sports report with Joey on the Globe.